while a PSV operator was given an opportunity to speak today in Nakuru with Dr. William Arapruto. He said, Nibangi tunavuta. Why are people taking a lot of money from us? This is what William Somoy Arapruto said. Na sisi, kama Kenya kwanza, mukituona tumeketi hapa. Tumeunganishwa. Mheshimiwa Musali ya Mudabadi, Weta, Moses Kuria, Alfred Mutua, UDA na vyama zetu zote tumeunganishwa na jambo moja uchumi wa taifa letu la Kenya. Hapo ndio that is the meeting point. And we have come to appreciate as the parties in Kenya kwanza that the, this moment in the Republic of Kenya is the economic moment and it is about getting every citizen of the Republic of Kenya and nobody to be left behind to be engaged in making sure that from the lowest we begin the journey to lift every citizen, every hustle so that together we can be prosperous as a country. Na ndiyo sababu hiyo tumekuja hapa. Na tunataka kuwasikiza. Tuko na about 11 huge informal settlements katika Nakuru County. Katika Nakuru Town tuko na Kwaronda, tuko na Bondeni, tuko na Kaptemboa. I'll give an example with where I come from in El Bagon Ward. There is a very huge informal settlement inaitwa Kasarani. In Kasarani Katika population El Bagon Town, tuko na more than 10,000 residents ambao wanaishi katika Kasarani. Na hizo ni more than 2,000 households. Watu kule wamejenga nyumba ambazo wamejenga back to back. Like wamejenga katika plots za 20 by 80 ambazo ni ndogo sana. Some people wakitaka pia kutafuta pesa pale wanajenga residential homes ndani ya zile plot so you can imagine plot moja inabeba watu wangapi we are not able to access clean drinking water pale pia kuchimba vyo inakuwa ni shida kwa sababu ka plot ni kadogo hakuna mambo ya privacy na vile ambavyo kuko na watu wengi sana pia crime rates ziko juu limitation to access of education na mambo mengine mengi sasa kitu ambacho ningeomba serikali ya Kenya kwanza through your excellency tukipata hii kiti na ninaamini ya kwamba tutaipata i would like us to have proper planning and decongestion tufanye proper planning ya our towns whereby we shall decongest these people the government can buy land ambayo itaweza ku decongest wale watu pia tutaweza kufanya proper planning ya town zetu ili to prevent mushrooming ya other informal settlements ili to square tunafanya spiral work tunamaliza zingine as others come up na hizo other 11 settlements ambazo mmesema ili tuwajenge manyumba ya orofa wenyewe wanaishi mahali ambapo ni mahali pazuri na pia tuweke pale hospitali tuweke shule tuweke maji kuhakikisha kwamba wale watu wako na choo mahali pazuri ili tufanye mambo mawili tuwasaidie mkuwe na mahali pazuri pa kuishi na vile vile vijana wetu wapate nafasi ya ajira so tutasaidiana na county government ili kuimprove uh, situation ya housing